dearly beloved, we are gathered here on this beautiful day to witness a union of Michael and Nicole in holy matrimony. This is a day of great celebration and reverence on which we come together before the universe to recognize and commemorate the sacred love and dedication shared between these two people. It is wonderful to have family and friends here to join us today. The groom and bride would like to thank their guests for being here. We would like you to know that each of you were invited here on this day because you have played an integral part of their intertwining lives. Marriage is a sacred ceremony. Today we observe the union of these two people with respect the occasion warrants. What we honor with reverence, however, we also celebrate with great joy. For married life, a shared life is a tremendous blessing. I, Michael, take you, Nicole, to be my friend, my lover, the mother of my children, and now my wife. To find someone as special as you and as loving and as caring is something I never could have imagined. You're forever my best friend and one true love. Marrying you today not only makes me the luckiest man in the world, but the happiest. I promise to perfect love and perfect trust. I promise to cherish and respect you. I promise to be right by your side and love you from now until eternity. You are and always will be the love of my life, my soulmate, and the woman of my dreams. <laughs> Nine years ago, you captured my heart by being exactly who you are. I don't know how or why I became deserving of you. Today is overwhelming. I can't tell you the amount of joy I have in my heart, simply thinking about you and the man you've become. Oh, God. <laughs> you make me unbelievably proud, and I promise that I'll make you proud as your wife. You have been the reason that I smile, and you have given me comfort beyond measure when I have cried. We've been through ups and downs and many life changes together, but never once were you hesitant in our love. You are greater than my wildest dreams. You are incredible. There are many times I look at you and you don't even know. I just think about how fulfilled I am and how you lead me and our children so well. 
I promise to be patient, understanding, faithful, and honest, to listen, value your opinion, have tough conversations. I promise to continue to work on myself in order to love you better and work hard to support our love, lifestyle, and family. I promise to push you to be your best self and allow you to push me to do the same, to always want the best for you and work to help you achieve your dreams. I cannot wait to love you forever and hold your hand wherever we go. Always and forever, your wife. Michael, do you take Nicole to be your lawfully wedded wife? By making this commitment, you are joining in the sacred covenant of marriage. Do you promise to honor and love to be sensitive to needs, to comfort her in difficulty, and to pull your full trust and complete trust in her, so as long as you both shall live. I do. Nicole, do you take Michael to be your lawfully wedded husband? By making this commitment, you are joining in the covenant of marriage. Do you promise to honor him in love, to be sensitive to his needs, to comfort him in difficulty, and to put your full and complete trust in him, so as long as you both shall live? By the power vested in me, by the Universal Life Church, by the state of California, I pronounce you, Michael and Nicole, as husband and wife, lawfully wedded before the universe. Michael, you may be kissed your bride. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my pleasure to present to you Mr. and Ms. Kakong. Even though I might not say it, I appreciate all you do, and thanks for being the greatest mother to my grandsons and the best wife and friend to my son. I feel very blessed to have a daughter-in-law just like you, and I love you. May your love burn bright for all the years to come. If you have half the love for each other that I feel for your mother right now, you guys will make 20 years, no problem. 